It's a sight not usually seen on the ranges, as locals were given the chance to walk and cycle around the vast land and get the chance to see how well the area is looked after and protected. Um, people are very grateful that we put on the effort and, um, and they've learned a lot and it's dispelled a lot of rumours and, uh, you know, and people, one person said, why have you not done this before? Because, you know, I've been able to answer all the questions I ever had about Zena. OK, well, he's answered them. It's been used as a training area since 1870. Today, its primary use is to prepare troops for deployment. Well, the area has been developing uh, in a continuous process uh, to meet the training requirement. And we now have a number um, of FOBs out there, Afghan villages, to try and make sure that the soldiers are as well trained and prepared as they can be prior to operations. It's the first time the ranges have been opened up to the public, and as troops begin to look towards the drawdown from Germany over the next few years, it gives the German population the chance to decide how the ranges will be best used in the future. There was a lot of discussions in the German community about what they're going to do with the Senna once we leave after 2018-2019. And, and so therefore, what I wanted them to do was be able to do so from an informed basis, um, having seen the place and worked out for themselves what we do here. For ourselves in the German army, um, it's quite important because we are actually, we'd love this to remain a training area as well because it's, we have one of the biggest or largest German camps um, on uh, uh, near here in Augustdorf and it'd be brilliant if we could have the training area here. So um, it's very good uh, that the civilians actually see what we're doing here or the British Army or even the Bundesforce and what they've been doing here just to make sure that they know that it's been taken care of for the last couple of years. Both German and British military were showcasing their armoured vehicles and working together throughout the day. It's the first time uh, it's been open for the German public, so it's good for them to have a look around and then uh, we can show them what we do on the area as well. Loads of people here, it's good fun. I like working in the British Army, gets my English going again. So, Who knows what the future holds for these ranges, but what can be assured is that the area is very well looked after and the information day was a great success. Amy Matthews, Forces News, Senelaga, Germany.